the importance of pitch count. My name is Glenwood Jones, and I can be reached at area code 701-532-0787, Fargo, North Dakota. The street address and mailing address is 4302 13th Avenue South, Suite 4 187, Fargo, North Dakota. The zip 58103. The fax number is area code 701 356 880. Five. Dearly beloved, the email address is jonesglenward at yahoo.com. I want to hear from you and the importance of staying connected with you, the Fargoans of Fargo, North Dakota, as well the department, if you allow me, exterior. Those of the exterior of West Fargo is an important strength in any political dilemma. We want to discuss with you very quickly pitch count. And I spell pitch for you, P-I-T-C-H, count, C-O-U-N-T. The North Dakota High School Activities Association has no plans to change to a pitch count However, if the coaches wanted to, the NDHSAA would have no problem switching. Their stance is fine either way. If their coaches wanted to go to that, they'd be fine with that. And this was told by NDHSAA Assistant Director Justin Fletchchuck, a former North Dakota State and Fargo Moorhead Red Hawks pitcher. A lot of the states that are doing this are Southern states where they play baseball year round. He think most of our coaches are pretty protective of pitchers in April. And he wouldn't be surprised if even the National Federation of State High School Associations in the next five to 10 years changes it from innings to pitches. Dr. Prasad Siwadikar is an orthopedic surgeon at Essentia Health in Fargo. And he's been a team director with the Florida Marlins, Pittsburgh Pirates, and the University of Miami. He stresses that parents not have their child play baseball year round and pitch counts are needed. In general, the overwhelming factor leading to injury and in throwing athletes is overuse, especially for younger age groups. So Watakar stated it's critical. Pitch count and type of pitches thrown definitely need to be limited. Younger kids are more vulnerable than older kids because their joints are yet growing. And we too would like to emphasize how important with this particular program and that's in turn experience program. From June 1st to August the 5th, weekly sessions. Interns are awesome, and Emerging Prairie wants to give them the best 
experience of their life. That's why they started the intern experience program. It gets interns to know each other in the Fargo Moorhead community. The eight week program to open to interns working for any organization. Participating interns are put into the small groups for weekly sessions that focus on developing skills. And these skills are soft skills, fostering friendship among the interns and engaging them in the community in addition there are also four large group sessions where interns hear from leaders and the community. The end result is a summer long experience. And with this summer long experience that has a lasting impact on all who participate. The cost is $150 per intern, registration required, and you can go to emergingprairie.com slash intern dash experience dash Fargo. And I'm satisfied that you would be glad that you did. And we want you to benefit from these necessaries.